Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Grounded. So today, as I mentioned last time, we are going to try and finish off the lower yard as much as possible. So I think first plan is going to go over to here and get the missing burgle chip. So it's only an auxiliary chip so it's just a minor upgrade but it's good to get it. I think that's the last one we have on the lower yard. And then hopefully that sets the time limit quite well for us getting this chip over here. I can't remember what time specifically it needs to be for the treasure to appear. Um, but we'll try and get there for the afternoon so obviously the game doesn't pause when I'm in my menus. That's the setting I've got turned on. So let's just try and quickly head out if we can and get the sunken burgle chip ASAP. So, first thing we're going to need is a stabbing weapon, because there's going to be some diving bell spiders down there, and then we're also going to need some swimming gear, and that's actually upstairs, so let's go get that real quick as well. Uh, here it is, so let's put that on. Safe. Safe fur. Uh, we've got no upper body part, um, so let's just take that off manually and still wear that. Okay, and let's quickly zoom over that. Now I don't know where this infected wolf is. Sounds like he's inside the oak. So we should be okay. We're going so fast here. Alright, so we're going to jump straight down back to the depths as quickly as we can. And we've also got, actually got a couple other bits in here, actually. We'll get that when we come back up. If we've got time. I think I've gone way too far over. You know what, let's do that first because... Oh, hello. I'll take this. Lovely. So let's go in here first. Now that we've got the assistant manager keycard, we've actually got something in here we can open. So let's just quickly do that. Uh, still got plenty of oxygen. Uh, here we go. Let's open this. Um, sturdy marble. A button. Uh, I don't actually remember a button being in here, but okay. And we've got this, which is a new charm. And I think that's it for this section. Um, I can't actually remember what this button just opened. Huh. I'm sure we'll figure it out. Uh, anything over here? No, I think we've already potentially done that bit. Um, let's get out of here before we drown. I actually forgot to look for the coin, that was brave. Oh god, there it is. I think it's trapped, that's uh, always handy. So let's quickly get up and get some air. I know we're gonna use the bubbles, but. We're also getting chased by something. Okay, so. Need to try and get down to the depths. Just thinking about it. God, it's been a bit of a messy episode already. Um, we're actually going to go down to the pond lab and go through that way instead. And pray that he does not release himself. Ah, you know what? I didn't bring a freaking torch. Honestly, that should be in like my motto. So we do need a torch. Because we won't be able to see a thing in there. So I'm going to pause here and then I'm going to go grab a torch and I'll catch you back here in about two seconds. Okay, I am back at base and I'm actually going to just craft this Everchar torch, which we can actually do now, which is quite cool. Um, thankfully we got some green shield bug parts when we were in the upper yard and 
destroying those tier 3 web stacks. So, very nice to have. The Evercharge torch can be used underwater and on the surface, and it can also be recharged with charcoal. So, I'm going to make this, and then I'm going to go back to the pond, so I'll catch you there. Okay, so we are back in the pond lab, and now I'm actually ready with all my gear to progress further. Now, I know that there's an upgrade chip. Well, I know there's a few upgrade chips around. I just don't know where they are, so I'm not sure if there's one here. I can't remember now. Um, just have a quick look around. I am not seeing one anywhere. Probably just being blind, but... Uh, have those haven't grown back, have they? No. Just check the very top. Uh, oh, there it is. Hello there. Super disc. Perfect. So that's Super Disc 2. Thank you very much for the person who left that in the comments a while ago. Much appreciated. And now we can head back into the depths. So let's put my new shiny torch on and dive down under. So, get my bearings here. This way, I think. Could do is some more of this stuff. There's also a um, scabby somewhere nearby. Uh, there's that it. Oh yeah, nice. That was lucky. So there's the scabby. days of saying I should have brought a torch. Okay, did we get everything from in here? I think we did. Um, gonna get these two, get some air, and then we'll continue where we actually were intending to go in the first place. Let's just go get some air back in the base, the lab. And I think we need to go over there. I think that's where it is. So let's just put my spear back on. Just in case something goes wrong, let's actually set our respawn here. Because it would not be the first time that I've drowned on this game. Let's see if we can find the key for the chest. So it's so easy to miss it as well. I found it just by luck the first time. Um, this isn't it, but I was wondering if that was another secret area, but it's not. Um, and now I probably won't be able to find it at all. There is a hole to swim into somewhere. I think I've missed it. I think it's over here. Here we go. So, <laughs> it's so easy to miss it, but this is, this is the entrance to find the key. It's pretty ridiculous. Kill some spiders and that will fill our oxygen. There we go, gosh. They are very loud, wow. That's yeah, a marble over there. Ready for the oxygen. 
oxygen. Let's see if we can actually get in here. I don't think we can. That's a bit of a bit of a weird place to put some marble if it's not even reachable. Nope, I cannot get in there. Oh, grab that one. Ah, not worth it. Let's continue. Uh, if you're ever going to come through here, by the way, make sure you bring multiple torches because I've lost my torch while in here and it is near enough impossible to find your way back out. Done. There should be just a key here. I thought that was it there. Oh, there it is. So there's the mossy key. That's the key item we came for. I've got no scanners saying there's anything else of importance down here, but let's just have a quick look. So there used to be a backpack in here. Um, but I think they got rid of that. This never used to be here, I don't think. It's a little air bubble, but I think that's it. So that's that. Now let's go up in the chest and get the auxiliary uh, chip. Just trying to think where that door. We pressed a button that opened a door. Don't know if that's in the tadpole bit. Maybe. Um, let's get some air. And then we'll head down to the chest and then go in that tadpole area and see if it's opened a door over there. Let's collect a few of these things on the way. There was a bone over there, but I'm lazy. So there's a milk molar. Hmm. Milk molar somewhere. Oh, is it going to be inside this chest, maybe? Very well, could be. Yes, it is. Let's open this with a key. And there's our milk molar. Mega milk molar. And the auxiliary chip. So that is that. I think we've got one final area to search in the pond, and then we will head over to the sandbox and get the other key. Just swimming up here because I think I remember there being a collectible. Oh, yep, raw science is getting picked up. I can't remember if it's down here or if it's actually on the surface above. I think it might be above. Let's just get out of here. Quick and get these. Okay. Let's hopefully not drown. I can hear the koi. I can see the koi. It is no longer stuck. Please stay away. I 
Everything's circling. Okay. Do we have a window? I think we do. Let's go. Alright. Should be safe from the coit. We need to get up here. I'm swimming very slow. Oh boy. Quick. This is where we are wanting to go. And we are in. Okay. So I'm thinking, is this where the door opened? No, we opened this one with a keycard. This is a different door entirely. Oh, hello. We'll take all of this. Give it to me. Can't reach this one. There we go. Oh, and quartzite. Take all of that. And marble. Lovely. Take all of that. Uh, is that it? Just a few resources? Hmm, okay. I was expecting more, but... Fair enough. So that door that we opened in the other area, I don't know where that is. Really don't. feathers for us to collect while we're here. Doesn't look like it. Okay, so there's only one other area I can really think nice might clean. have that door. Yum! two places. Back at the black ant lab, perhaps. Which is where we're going anyway, in that area. Or one of the other pond sections. So the koi is here. Somewhere. I'm just swimming around right now and seeing if anything gets picked up on the radars. Any raw science, milk molars. I am pretty sure there is a passageway that leads down under the oak lab. I might actually just go in the oak lab and follow it the other way so it's easier to find it. So I'm not sure where it comes out. Also, this torch is amazing. It hasn't even started running out yet. Let's give Burgle the chip. Can I help you today? Ah, more chips. Hand it over and let it. Much better. Check the ASL Terminals of Science Shop for the new recipes. How can I be of assistance? So what we've unlocked there is Sunken Outpost Chip, so Splatburst Recipe, which is basically the bombs, but they stick to whatever they touch. Fin Flops Upgrade, which allows you to swim even faster, quite handy. And Dive and Lighten Upgrade, which is a bit obsolete now that we've got this other one. Actually, might get the Finflops upgrade. Possibly. 
Mm, actually, no. You know what? I'm just going to leave it. But let's first of all put our new upgrade super duper disc in here. Perfect. And now we're going to follow the water from inside here to outside just to see if there's anything along the way. So down this very scary hole. Again, there used to be a backpack down here, but I'm not sure what is down here now instead. I don't remember there being lap. broken lap parts down here, to be honest. But what's this? Is this just a torch? Yeah. That's a torch. That's the pathway that continues out, I think. We've obviously got raw science here, so let's go like that. There's also a scabby somewhere. Um, getting stuck. There's a scabby. I think that might be everything in here, actually. And. Now we just need to follow this path out. So this is raw science. Take that. I feel like I saw something there. Oh, a molar. Okay. We are running low on air, so I hope there's not too much further to go here. Um, quick. Okay, so we've got that. Apparently there's raw science still somewhere. There it is. Okay, there's some creatures here which will allow us to fill our oxygen back up, which is good. Come on. Right, there we go. Oxygen refilled. here, which, to be fair, was like one of the first uh, early access versions of the game. I don't think there's going to be anything else, but I'm not 100%. That's where I came in. Click that. Let's just collect a bit of this. Why not? Ooh. Falling. Okay, and I think there was another route out here. I think this should lead out into the actual pond. And whereabouts is this actually just for my... Oh, we were way off. It's actually in the middle of the pond. Filtration tablets needed. So it's night time. The final thing we're going to do is we're going to just have another look around here. There's some raw science inside of here. A few other bits and bobs around as well. Try not to get eaten. 
but again, just keeping an eye on the um, on the scanners. So, um, okay. So I didn't actually mean to find this, but this could work. Bin that. Don't need that. So we've been in here before, but did that open any doors? Uh, might as well take them. Put the space. This leads back down to the pond lab area. Um, there's a pond lab over there. So let's just have a swim around down here. the wrong way. Uh, that looks like the way out. Oh, is this the, from my back at the pond lab? Yeah, I've just done a big thing in circle. Well, I'm not sure how they both didn't see me. Some of these ones will though, that's for sure. We're going to have a final swim down the left side of the pond now and see if anything gets picked up on the scanners. It's not great that it's night time. I also don't know where the koi is. Alright, there's a molar. It could be outside of the pond though. Could be down here. There's uh, some science. There it is. How do we get that? Nice. Cool. So that was worth coming back for. because I can't see it. Okay, good. Mm. 
not bad. Um, I'm going to sleep in the bed in here. Go back out in the day. sandbox to find the last key. But I think we're done in the pond. Raw science, which is here. Okay, good. So we weren't actually finished. So we'll take that. Head back to base, and then we'll head over on the zip line back to the sandbox. Can we spend any milk molar points? We got three of each. Arrow stack, not too fast on that one. Um, three to spend here. Um, I'll get a stamina increase. didn't have any plant fire bat at the base when I was making the torch. Lunch. That didn't eat. A little chewy, but not bad. Cool, that'll do. Let's head back. Is moving. Ladybird, maybe. Yep, I can hear it. Um, I heard the infected wolf. 
Not sure where it is. I can't see it. I'll take that. Okay, quick deposit. I'm going to have to deposit these manually. Sort the inventory out. Let's get a couple extra bandages. Or well, ten. Um, don't want that. Gonna need water because we're going into the sandbox, so let's just take a second canteen. Fill both of them up. Cool, and then uh, set this as respawn. Need to go get our antlion armor. Follow the heat resistance. And then I think we can just head straight over to the sandbox area now. I uh, don't have many healing items like, and we're going in the sandbox, so that could be a problem. So let's very quickly craft some of those heals. I'll do. And that's head. I'm I was going to knock me off there. Okay. Right, so this is respawn. again. Um, so for this one, I think we have to wait till half past three. Um, and then that shovel over there will cast a shadow, revealing where we need to dig in order to get the key. Um, what are ant lines weak to again? Because we could probably do with killing a few whilst we're here. Uh, data and lines are weak to slashing and salty. Are they resistant to spicy? They might be. Yes. So we're going to have to use this. And let's just run through. It's going to hurt. Cha -cha. It's burning. So we're just going to take them on as and when they come. 
I'm um, gonna change to that. anything unless I throw it, but let's just do it anyway. Alright, we're looking for sparkles whilst we wait for half three to arrive. Dig whatever treasure we can find. It's like salt. And almost get into half three. Kind of get rid of any distractions. If we can, let's just confirm it is half three. Yes, I think that's half three. So that's a clock face. That'll give us the key in the middle of that shadow, which will open the chest under the sand castle. Yeah, I thought you were just a book. Filtration tablets needed. Okay, so almost half two. And the shadow is moving that way. Don't know if we can dig the treasure up before the time arrives. But Maybe it doesn't appear. 
appear until after he arrives. I'm not sure. Uh, this area is too hot for me. I don't want to get rid of that ant line, but I think we should be okay. Okay, almost there. 40 minutes in game. Looks like it's gonna reach up over here. But I cannot see it. 28 minutes, I think it's only gonna reach around about this area. Hopefully I've not read the time wrong and it's not and it actually is half three. Fifteen minutes. There we go, here it is, so almost half three. And I think this is gonna be the key. Take that. And now let's go open the chest. We also do have the sandcastle to actually explore, but it's a little bit awkward. chest. Take that, and we'll take this little piece of paper. That shows us how to make the salt morning star. Now in terms of actually getting into here, I think the best way is actually just jumping off the edge over to there, which we can't do right now. So we'll come back and do that another time, perhaps. We also need to build up to the top in order to get the, the milk. I think it's a milk molar on top. So I'm just checking something, because we pressed a button in the pond which opened a door, and the only other place I can think that is going to be is here, but I am not certain at all. Lots of apple bits in here. I'll take that. 
take all of them. Avoid these soldiers. And all of these soldiers. There's a locked door up there, but I think that is open from doing all of the, uh, what you call them, machines, mixer machines, which I don't think it is actually here. Yeah, this is open from doing mixer machines, not from that button I press. Yeah, not too sure. I might have to give that a Google. Or if you know, let me know down below. The button I pressed in the lab, the pond, one of the pond lab, like little subsections after using the assistant manager key card, opened a door. Um, I was not too sure where that door was. Might not be an important door to be honest, but it'd be good to know. So, gonna call it an episode here. We've now finished the most of the uh, lower yard. So next episode, we venture on to the upper yard and see if we can take on some stronger opponents. Maybe even kill a couple sickly roller polies down here before we leave this area and see how that goes. But for now, that'll do us. So thank you again for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It helps the channel a lot. And I'll catch you all on the next one.